Welcome back, YouTubers and Madden fans. This is Madden Money Shot. Look at my lovely CFM team. Oh my goodness, look at all these bronze cards you can just wipe your ass with. If you're like me and you just got this game and you refuse to buy packs, uh, you're probably having a hard time right about now competing. Even in regular solos, that can be difficult with how bad these teams are. So with that in mind, I decided to come up with uh, some budget beasts for you guys to go out there and pick up so that you can compete or at least you can fill holes in areas that you might need it. So I only have about 4,000 coins, and I'm going to go through these guys. Quarterbacks, I got Brent Hundley. Uh, he's a, a speed and throw power guy. You're not going to find necessarily an accuracy top-notch quarterback in a low-costing card, but he's a guy, at least you can run with the quarterback. That's pretty much the, the theme of these quarterbacks. I also got Jeff Driscoll. I actually bought this guy because he looks pretty similar to Brent Hundley, but he's a 68 overall. He's got speed, which is important. Because at the end of the day, if your quarterback can't pass, at least you can run with him, right? So continuing in that trend, the next quarterback I got, when you think of quarterbacks that are cheap and uh, they have good physical attributes, they're typically rookies or recently drafted players like Joshua Dobbs. Uh, you know, he's the he's same thing, speed, throw power, or recently drafted busts like Geno Smith, Robert Griffin the third I was going to put on here, but he was a little bit too expensive. The idea behind these guys is they're pretty cheap. Running backs, the first one I got is Naheem Hines, another rookie. You're going to see a lot of rookies and recently drafted players. He's a guy, he's not too expensive, he's got good speed. Uh, another one, Matt Breda from the San Francisco 49ers. He's a decent uh, speed guy. They have a couple of decent speed guys. Also, Raheem Moss Mostert. He used to play for the Eagles, actually. He was on our uh, preseason one year. Um, he's got good speed. I actually bought him. You know what I mean? A couple of these guys I bought. I only got 4,000 in coins, but I'm buying a couple of these cards to improve my team. Ronald Jones the second. He's got good speed, good acceleration. Tariq Cohen, to compare these guys, he's an 85 speed, 85 acceleration. All the guys I just showed you were 86s. Damian Bird. This guy's faster than my 83 Brandon, uh, Brandon Cooks card, which is crazy. So I bought him too. He was also cheap. Under 1,000. I only have 4,000 to spend, so I got to spread it around. JJ Nelson, he's a little bit on the expensive side, 4,000, but he's got top notch speed uh, with 88, with, you know, an 88. He's not tall. A lot of these guys that are, that are fast aren't tall. Like Bird's not tall. Uh, Philip Dorsett's not tall, but you're getting an 87 speed. He's got a better jump than Brandon Cooks as well, but he's like 5'10 again as well. Uh, Randy Moss, I'm comparing him to him because that's a little bit better of a comparison. Curtis Samuel, this guy's also a little bit on the expensive side. It depends on when you buy him. You gotta you gotta be smart when you get these guys. But uh, it's not showing his stats, but he's like an 88 speed. Then you got Brashad Perriman. People forget about him. 87 speed, he's like 6'4. Uh, Niles Paul, here's a great tight end. He's one of my favorite tight ends. You can get him nice and cheap. I think he's like 1500. I would have bought him, but I'm all out of coins already. Uh, Moritz Bowringer. This guy was a receiver, just like Niles Paul. Uh, usually when guys go from receiver to tight end, they have some pretty good uh, speed attributes and catching attributes. On the defensive side, here's Brandon uh, Copeland. I bought him too. He was only a couple hundred coins. Um, he's got some good speed off the edge. I mean, he's a 79 speed. That's terrific for a silver card. Uh, one of the faster players. Here's Jordan Willis, another guy, right end. Uh, 79 speed as well. Not too expensive. Speed kills, man. Speed's everything in this game. I mean, you can get guys like this cheap. Uh, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you know, strike when you can. Linebackers, Camus Gruber Hill. This guy's basically just a special teamer, but he's an 82 speed. That's perfect for a nice user middle linebacker, or you can just let him roam and do his own thing. But he's definitely got elite speed. Couple more linebackers. Shaquem Griffin. This guy's expensive. Everybody's gonna want him. He's got the highest speed out of any linebacker in the game in regular Madden. I'm not sure about him, but he's an 84 speed there. Then you can get a guy like um, you know Jordan Evans. The, the Bengals have a lot of sleeper speed guys, uh, as you're gonna see as we go on. The same thing with the Seahawks. That's why um, we're gonna go to them here pretty soon. Leon Jacobs. This guy right here, another rookie, 67 uh, overall, but with really good speed once again. Jalen Murick, another Jaguars guy, 89 speed. He might be the fastest cornerback in the game right now. And Anthony Brown, another speed guy, 88 speed. Not very tall though. Jonathan Jones from the Patriots, once again, 88 speed. This this is important. You can put these guys in the slot and just blitz them all the time. Perry Nicholson or Nickerson. I'm not even sure how to say his name. He's six foot though. They all, all the other guys were pretty much uh, under six foot. They're like 5'10". Um, and then Anthony. Anthony Averett, another guy, A7 speed, six foot tall. You can put these guys outside. Fabian Moreau, this guy here, hurt his rookie season, so people forget about him, but he's a great athlete. I think he's an A6 speed. Then you got this guy, I love Quentin Dunbar, man. Six foot two with an A4 speed. Give me that six foot two cornerback size any day of the week. Devontae Bisbee, I'm not sure how you say his name. Six foot two, once again, 80 speed. I think he's actually underrated. He's faster than, than that in real life. Um, then going on to the safeties, we got Natrell Jamerson. This guy here, um, I didn't even catch his speed, but uh, he wouldn't make this list if he wasn't fast. 
Josh Jones, another guy, 85 speed. That's pretty much the threshold right here. You're going to see a lot of 85 speed guys. Justin Reed, another rookie, uh, actually a strong safety. I'm going to mix the safeties up here. Uh, but he's. I think he was known for having pretty good hit power too. Josh Robinson, I bought this guy. He's dirt cheap. I didn't even look at his speed. I just bought him right away because I knew that when he was a couple hundred coins, that uh, that's, all I had, <laughs> that's all I had left anyway. So I knew he was going to be fast any, regardless. But 84 speed, I'll take that. It's faster than any guy I got. Kentrell Bryce off the Packers, another good one. And then, like I said, uh, the, the Seahawks have a lot of guys. Tyvis Powell, six foot two, uh, with pretty good speed, 83, not elite. He's actually playing for the Niners now, anyway. Uh, Trey Flowers, here's the guy I was talking about from the Seahawks. Another guy, six foot three, 81 speed. You gotta love guys like that. Delano Hill, another guy, strong safety. Uh, he's just six foot two or six foot three. I'm not even sure, but uh, that's really why I like him, other than his speed. Speed's a 78, but that's fine for a safety. Uh, and then Maurice Alexander, I got some gameplay with this guy coming up here pretty soon. He's an A3 seat speed, six foot one. He used to be like a really good player when he was with the Rams, and he's just kind of like a backup now with the Seahawks, I guess. Um, so that's pretty much it. Now I, I, I improved my team with just five purchases, maybe four. I'm not even sure. Maybe four purchases of these guys, and I improved my team already to 67. I actually had up to a 68. I don't know what happened to that image. But uh, I, I reset my roster and it went to a 67 and I couldn't figure out how to get back to the 68. Either way, that's it. Uh, skill position sleepers. If you guys want to see more mutt tip videos, make sure to hit the like button or let me know in the comment section. Uh, it really helped me out and then I'm going to keep giving them to you. Other than that, thanks for watching Mad Money Shout Out. Need more help or just want to show your support? Then head over to my Patreon and join my team where you can get exclusive content like ebooks and bonus plays as well as early access to my bids and more. Link in the description below.